What is up, you guys? Hope you smash that like button, bu button, and I hope you guys subscribe. And your day is super lit. Without any further ado, let's get into it. Before we get in the vlog, I have one more thing to say. This is the comment of the day. We're not gonna let you die yet, so don't be afraid. Yeah, that was that was trash. But still, welcome to the vlog. For real this time. Come every day one time. Oh, man, that never works. There's one secret I haven't told you guys in the short time that I had this channel. Here it is. I've been tracking Bigfoot all over the world. We have been everywhere. Everywhere in the United States-ish. We went in zigzag lines trying to find this man. We have tracked him and tracked him and tracked him. And we have only seen him half of a second. We saw one hair fly in the wind and we knew it was his because we could smell the scent of Bigfoot that is how close we are to finding this man finally four years of searching I found him right here in my backyard in Stafford Virginia right here so you know this is what we're looking for guys this is what we're looking for right there right there red circle if you're colorblind I'm sorry he's right there so here's our equipment that we have. We have the um the claws cause like we gotta track the males, you know. The males love claws on women. I just learned that. Um I was learning that on YouTube, I watched it on YouTube. Um the another thing that we have, we all you have to wear green because like they love love green. Like they will come to anybody who wears green, I swear. And then the last thing all male people like about Girls, yes, I'm talking about Bigfoot girls, females. It's right here. Let me go get it. Right here. All male Bigfoots love women with witch hatches, hatches, hats on. They love it. They will legit marry you if you wear a witch hat. I've learned this, and I'm a professional Bigfoot hunter. Nobody knows because I was in the FIB, which is Federal Incorporate Bigfoot Hunters, right there. So let's go into the backyard and find him. I was out here searching for like 10 minutes, and I finally walked up these steps in my backyard and then I found this right here pizza box so I was like oh pizza someone left me some pizza in my backyard so then I opened it and I was like oh man there's no more pizza so then I looked up I was like oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh <sighs> Bigfoot was here right here in my backyard he left it right there it says Bigfoot was here. If you're colorblind, I'm sorry, you probably can't read that. But it says Bigfoot was here. Right there. On this box. So we're gonna keep searching for some clues so we can find them. Okay, so like an hour after I found that pizza box, I found this right here. It was all stacked up in my backyard. I'm gonna show it to you. So we found this pile of sticks right here, and it's piled up in a teepee. Everybody knows what that means. That means Bigfoot was here, and if you leave a pot, that means that he liked it here, especially if it's broken, or it means that he's smoking weed, either one, but still. It's right here. We have proof that he's here. We're gonna keep trying to find him, get the DNA test, get the video proof for y'all, everything we're gonna hit him with the stick too if it tries to tries to get us and it makes me look professional impossible after like right after i found this stick and i was showing y'all the smoke pot tp thing over there i found this here this is a giant footprint of bigfoot 
right here. We are on the way to finding this man. I think he walked all the way over, like, over there somewhere. But still, it's right here that I'm hitting it with this stick. I'm so excited. I just wrote the stick. But who cares? Look, Bigfoot, everybody knows he has three toes. One, two, uh, three. And then he has a bottom of the foot. Everybody, everybody has that. Unless you don't have feet. Sorry for you. Um, here it is right here. We just, we gotta find this man. We gotta find him. Not shortly after I found that, that thing over there. The big footprint. I found this right here. I think we're near his campsite. So, so close to finding him. Here, I think our guy was cooking up some stuff. No telling what it was. Probably some ramen noodles, you know. Um, probably stole it from inside my house. There's a pot right there. And, um. Here's his fire thing. Oh, crap. Here's his fire thing right here. He's probably lighting some fires, having parties and stuff. Uh, probably sitting right here on this step, lighting some fires and stuff. Um, I don't know. Let's keep exploring. We have found the unimaginable right here. We have found Bigfoot Swiffer right here. It looks like he just used some wood and stuff. He was just going around his my backyard, his house, I guess. He was just Swiffering around, doing some yard work. You know, um, that's kind of cool. I guess we'll find him, man. Um, I think I know where he is right now. Right now. I cannot believe we saw Bigfoot today. But, you know what we haven't seen yet today? my subscriber count go up to 50. So if you guys could take care of that, I will be doing some insane stuff. Maybe the egg challenge, definitely not the Tide Pod challenge, um, water challenge, I don't know, straight arm challenge. Anything you guys put in the comments and it is actually reasonable, I will do it. If you get 50 subscribers, if you just give me 50 subscribers. Maybe get this video a couple likes to smash that like button just because we saw Bigfoot. Bigfoot. And thank you guys for all of the support. Means a lot to me. You guys kept me going. You know what? No, I was going to say dab. I've been on them haters. I'm on the haters, but that's already taken. Hit the folks on them haters. That was so bad. Bye.